new outer space story called Pumpkinhead meets Terry and Christina. Ha ha ha. Part one. It looks like this from my tablet on my Instagram. Me, that chocolate face, and my woman, Christina. Oh, but that ugly freak, that strange creature, the monster pumpkin heads right there. Then there's a rocket ship, an astronaut. I put all that together, but glory to God. Amen. Turn off the lights. Oh, it's too hard to see me. Hey, <laughs> never mind. It says, let me sit down. A mixed couple and their friends must try to survive against a famous monster. Introduction. I always give Jesus Christ the glory for my creative mind. Amen. I'm a big fan of the original Pumpkinhead movie that came out in the year 1988. And I thought it would be cool to make this creature a special guest for this adventure that I'm making up. This demon will only get you if you did something wrong to someone else. My scary, funny movie Begins with two brothers driving their car vroom, very fast on a dark night. And they just left a birthday party for one of their college roommates and everybody was drunk. <sighs> uh. Peter and Eddie ran a red light <laughs> and accidentally hits the old man. <sighs> And his wife, who was trying to cross the street as fast as they could. The little younger brother, Eddie, is freaking out. Oh man, what we're going to do, bro? <laughs> because he thinks they are going to go to jail. Peter didn't mean to run over no one. It just happened so quickly. The two brothers don't see no one on the road. And they hide. The two dead bodies. And drive away. <clears throat> the brothers are crying. <laughs> what are we going to do? The, the brothers are crying. And feel bad. that, But they don't want to get locked up. So they leave the scene. They are speaking Russian to each other. I don't know. I'm just making this up. I don't know Russian in real life. But y'all know what I mean. They are speaking Russian to each other. In their language. But don't know that someone was watching them. From a distance. And Chantel. This mad black woman. <laughs> Who they think they are? They ain't gonna get away with this. <sighs> and Chantel, this mad black woman, decides to go to the country and talk to an old lady who can summon up pumpkin head and make the monster kill anyone who is responsible for murder. Ooh. Meanwhile, Terry and Christina are happy together. Meanwhile, Terry and Christina are happy that they were chosen to team up with five other folks from around the world to go on a top secret mission in a rocket ship. <sighs> the government wants to send some humans to outer space and pay for everything. Bowling, balling. They got the books, the cash. It was on the news 
Well, this is a special report tonight, brother. A deformed baby. Creature starts to get out of the ground. And the witch, that old lady, orders Pumpkinhead to hunt down Peter and Eddie. The tall monster growls. It sounds more scary than that than the movies, but y'all know what I mean. <laughs> the tall monster growls. He searches everywhere for the boys. Everyone gets out his way. You know, there's kids and adults and parents and teenagers and stuff. When they see this monster in town, they're like, hmm, what is that? And I don't know. Cops where, where, are looking for Peter and Eddie. They get lucky and arrest these guys. Okay, put your hands up. But we're sorry, we didn't mean that. I said, put them up. Y'all going to jail with me. We need to talk. To give y'all a clue what's going on, readers. Cops are looking for Peter and Eddie. They get lucky and arrest these guys at their home. Pumpkinhead goes to the police department. Yes, this monster goes downtown to the station where all the police officers are. The ugly freak gets shot up. He breaks the door down, goes in there. Cops say, put your hands up. Monster looks at him. They shoot him. He's like. Picks up a cop. Breaks his back. Pimp slaps another one. You know, he does all type of stuff. Grabs a, a rifle out of one of the cop's hand. Shoves it in his chest. Lifts him up like a shish kebab stick with beef and pork. Like he did in another movie. When he heard, when Pumpkinhead heard that poor guy on the ground. Stick him up with a gun and lifts him up. He do all type of stuff. Pumpkinhead can pick up a car. He's strong. Freaks are tough. Don't mess with them. They go anywhere. The ugly freak gets shot up, but he hurts the cops. And he breaks Eddie in half. Eddie was trying to get out of that place. But Pumpkinhead caught Eddie. And rips the poor boy apart. <laughs> and blood goes everywhere. Oh, guts. Ugh. There's blood everywhere. Peter escapes. The older brother, the big brother, got away. To be continued, hope y'all like the story so far. Sorry, folks, if it's, you know, disturbing, creepy and stuff. But it's supposed to be, in a way, make it more realistic-like, you know. It's a horror movie, so what you expect. But thank the Lord for helping me to make it up. And this story will have a good ending somehow. And God will get the glory somehow. Good night, y'all. Stay tuned for part two next time.